Oh, look at that! Oh, I wonder where he's planning. Surely it's not. <laughs> Please edit that in and edit in the time stopping sound effect. Hey, hey, every time he does that at the end of the zone, you have to make you have to add in that sound effect and then do the but also add in the um the um roundabout. So like right at the after I kill the boss, it starts playing the guitar riff. And then when I get there, you, he does the world out. And then after it freezes, it goes the two kit to the to be continued. Because that'd be oh, good that, lord. Hey, that'd be uh, on my eyes. Hey, we, I, I can try. Hey, we just gave you an end slate. <laughs> I can try. Uh, some people. This is the only good. You know, a lot of people think I don't edit. This is the only. Tell, tell that to Kingdom Hearts. Let's play. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, look, Marble Garden. You, you people know I'm cutting out attempts in the Mario Kart, right? Look, more Marble Garden! What? Why did my nose fall asleep? Is this night? Is this Marble Garden at nighttime? I had a point! I have lost it! This is the best stage in a Sonic what? CD. Oh, Fight me, Internet. What are you talking about? This is the only good stage in Sonic CD. Fight this, me, Internet. What, what level is this? This is Sonic CD? This is Stardust Speedway. What? Yeah. This is Stardust Speedway? Yeah. Do, you, do you not recognize the Lantern Badman? Well, no, not with all this moss! <laughs> not with all this moss. I, I Last time I remember, Stardust CD was like a bustling city. Sonic? Look, what? it's Sonic CD, Badniks. Oh wow! Get the blue orb. This isn't your average everyday Day darkness. darkness. This, this is, is advanced, advanced darkness. darkness. <laughs> you know that one messes me up. That little trick messes me up every time because I always want to move. But that's the point, right? It's like it, it's it's almost as ingenious as you having a. Harder game because you do more damage. Anyone want to watch Brian attempt Blue Sphere? Oh fuck y'all! Don't see that. <laughs> what? Y'all don't see that? Well, now we now we have to do it. <laughs> this is literally a video of Brian just playing the old Blue Sphere game. No, we live stream it. Or we could record it. Uh. it if Brian, um, in case. You don't know, um, on Sonic Mega Collections, um, one of the game options is the, um, Blue Sphere. Well, I've perfected it. Now let's show if I can finish it, because I'm pretty sure I've already messed it up too badly. You couldn't have messed it up. You perfected it. Nope. Ooh. No, because I missed yeah. that one you that last that time. You missed that one orb. See, so yeah, you started that one orb that I missed is what did it. I did not know that. Like, I couldn't tell. It's a completely it, separate- You had it, Mac, but then you let it go. But all of this level design from Sonic on CD- You know, um, to Look, give- you just broke a time capsule. To give Sean credit, the moss, man, but-, but like, Look, everything this isn't even the same level. But again, you have the Sonic CD badniks and a bunch of- Sonic Well, yeah, but this is like- This is like- so This is like Stardust Speedway after you left it. No, that's Act 2. Yeah, after you left it. No, Act 2 is the good future. What are you talking about? All of the bad futures have more metal. This level has less metal. No, this is actually based off of the, um... Carson, there was no moss! I think this is based off the good future, though. Well, I, that's what I'm saying, though. This is, this is a revisit to start a speedway. So wait, this isn't even a remake. This so is wait, a does revisit. That... So wait, does that mean in this timeline, um... Uh, whoa, Sonic... whoa, 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 hold on. I wasn't trying to get into timeline Sonic discussions <laughs> now, Carson. Whoa. You're the only one who's watched the Sonic timeline whoa. video. There's Sonic timelines? Uh, according to the one video Carson watched. It was a 50... Brian, people try to add a timeline to everything. It was they a 50 do, minute video. Shouldn't. Well, to, to at least be fair, Sonic 1, 2, 3 and Knuckles and CD are... Chronologically in order. Sonic CD is before two. Uh -huh. Look, um, unless the game distinctly goes either forward or backwards, 
You know, because there are times in the game, basically, you know, it's like one, one's present, two's, you know, after one, and then three, sometimes you'll get to three, and three will be like, hey, we're going to go before one. Three is always and a sometimes prequel. Sometimes you're like, yeah, yeah, that's cool. That's cool. That's all right. Three is usually a prequel for Unless some Unless the game does that, or deliberately has time as a giant element. <laughs> but Brian... All the Persona games take place in chronological order. That's cool. That's great. <laughs> but you want to know what happens in that situation? And some people think... You don't have discussions of timelines. <laughs> well, well, actually they do, because some people think that Shimagami all takes place in the same universe. It does. No, all of Shimagami, including Persona. Okay, that's amusing to me. You see again. It's this like is with the Zelda time. You see line. again. It's this like, is how I am amused. This is how you do a good reference because these bad nicks appeared in one room in um, Sonic CD, and there were only three of them. Oh wow! Oh Ooh, wow. fuck! Oh wow! Someone touched you, Hyper Beam. <laughs> and he didn't have to rest after that cheating <laughs> son of a bitch. Well, no, well, it's using well, uh, Carson. Actually, he did because he just did Hyper Beam and he held it for a long time. No, it's using Gen 1 logic. It ah, that's what it is. It I said me. cheating son of a bitch. It hit me so I could do it again. I love this transition. This is fucking clever. Oh my goodness. That is beautiful. Ha! Ah. I said it's the good future. Time travel is in this game. Time bro. travel. Let that sink in. Although, I mean, this is the world though, so. I still only have three KS Emeralds. And I did not find a special zone. Does this look like sort of speed? So it looks like we're gonna yes, have to. It does actually. So it looks like we're gonna have to replay stages and hypercut. This is what the level looks like normally. So I believe the. Act... This is what the present version of this stage looks like. So Act One is the past version. Um. Yes. Actual. Um. Uh, maybe. Yeah. It looks like. You know what it probably was. It looks like the past or the good With future. Bright version. pink and green color. Hold on. Wait. The Hold on. Wait. I need to hear the music. That's how you can tell. Damn, I don't remember the theme. And we haven't made it to the good part. Uh. Well, the music's cheery, so I assume it's the good future music. Man, I almost, I almost wish that um the for the well, Sonic. Looking at the wiki, I'm assuming that the first deck is the past, and that this is currently the good future. Turn on, turn on. Off of the wiki descriptions. You, the way, you actually, the way Sonic CD worked, you started in the neutral time, you could go to the past, and if you went to the past, you could change things so that the future... Well, I mean, he broke one of the robot makers, so if this is the future, then it's the good future. But I think this is new, the present, the neutral timeline. Because technically there's... Well, I know it's not the um, good future because there are bad dicks. Actually, a part of this music is lifted from Metal Sonic's boss theme, which is the bad future theme. No, but that's the normal stage music. I thought that was part of the... Hmm. I mean, it is in Sonic Generations, but that's actually the start of Speedway theme. No, the music that play Metal Sonic's boss theme in Generations is the Bad Future theme. Because in that timeline... Ah, dang it! Because in that timeline, I, I guess I Sonic... Know, oh, Speaking of Metal Sonic! Oh my gosh, it has one of the Metal Sonic generators. I want to call this moment pandering, but let's all be real. Metal Sonic is the only boss for Stardust Speedway. Wait, is this the is this the Stardust Speedway last? Yeah, this is the race. So yeah, mm -hmm. this is the good, Wait, this is literally the good future. Because the Good Future description says something about a race against Metal Sonic. Um, you always race Metal Sonic regardless but of, again, this music of is the timeline. But again, the music is actually the Bad Future music. The, bo the boss battles in Sonic CD don't change based on the time. All that changes is the layout and the stage music. Can anyone get this reference? Anyone know what that is? That's Silver Sonic. No! no. Isn't that from the um, Game Gear game? Yeah, that's from the Game Gear games. It's Silver Sonic. Yeah, it's making the Game Gear sound effects. It's 
That's the Silver Sonic from Sonic 2 on Game Gear. You know, I just realized that uh, the way he moved originally was probably a lack of Game Gear animation. version does have vines so you start in the past and then because he breaks the machine he goes into the good future i found a mm. i found a screenshot so <laughs> you do start in the past version and then go to the good future hmm. neat good future the good future in this image isn't that gold color hmm. so I believe you did go to the present then what is it called Sonic Forces this game is Sonic yeah, yeah, this, Mania. This is Sonic Mania. Mania. yeah. I'm talking about the other one yeah, I'm talking about Sonic CD the game because I, I just thought about something and I realized that Sonic Forces is pandering even more to nostalgia. How? Because something that I don't understand about uh, basically Metal Sonic is why is Metal Sonic still pictured as that Metal Sonic instead of Sonic Heroes Metal Sonic? Metal Overlord, he only looked like that because of the Chaos Emeralds. Okay. That's not. Oh the, yeah, the present one does have the. Still look cooler. That's He's not. Still... Other than his um man skirt. Yeah. Technically, Sonic Heroes is Neo. Or even worse, I don't understand why Shadow's on that side either. Uh, uh, time travel? What? Uh, time travel? The Sonic Heroes one is Neo Metal Sonic. Yes. And also, like I said, he looks like that because of the power from the Chaos Emeralds. Chaos Data has been copied. I mean, yeah, I mean, Carson needs a point. Apply a shadow on that side. Time travel. SA2. Yeah, it was called Neo Metal Sonic. I do love this design, though. I liked it when I was younger, but after someone pointed out the man skirt, I can't take it seriously. I mean, it looks better than the man skirt than that giant hole in his chest. Hey, that oh. hole fires lasers, so it has a purpose. I kind of wish for this a boss instead of it just being good teamwork, Tails. I kind of wish for this boss instead of it just being Silver Sonic from uh, the uh, Game Gear game. He should have gone through all the other like um, Metal Sonics. It should have been the like Silver Sonic from the Game Gear. Then it's like Silver Sonic from Sonic 2. Then like Mega Sonic. You know what would have been an obscure ass reference is if they had put in Pseudo Sonic. I think that's what that's called. Let's make Metal Sonic. And then years down the road, when we have basically Evil Sonic. Technically! We're instead going to use another Evil Sonic. Because Metal Sonic is literally the character that shows up and would be like, I saw Sonic do this and Sonic did that and blah 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 blah. But no, let's not use that character. Mm -hmm. Fuck that character. Shadow. Who's completely different color than Sonic, but literally gets cast as, Hey, I saw Sonic do this. Even though it was when Sonic had black hair and red shoes. It was dark when they filmed that. <laughs> you want to know what the problem with Sonic characters were? There weren't enough edgy ones. Shadow. Oh, shut up. Shadow of the Hedgehog isn't a bad game. Fight me, internet. It's terrible. It's a bad terrible game. I like Shadow Better than Sonic uh, 2! <laughs> oh, God. I like the game Shadow of the Hedgehog over 
Sonic 1, Sonic 2, Sonic Heroes. Well, when you say you like Shadow the Hedgehog, are we talking like Shadow the Hedgehog gameplay, level design, story? The, the gameplay... Don't say story. Just, just don't say story. The gameplay <laughs> and the level design I enjoy. As for the story... You see that 3D model in the background? Wouldn't it be possible on a Genesis? Ruined forever. My immersion is ruined. What kind of a sprite is that? What, what what do you mean? You, you saw Metal Sonic Sprite. Oh, his flying pose? He looked like he had pedo hands. <laughs> you know, this is kind of a very uneventful second um, phase of the boss. Uh, oh, and when I say that, you get hit. Now, don't die. <laughs> what did I just say? Well, I didn't know what he was going to do. Whoa. I wasn't prepared. That better have a fucking checkpoint. <laughs> no. no. Nope. It's starting all Dang. the way over. Game ain't fucking around. No, it's not. Okay, you see, that's the exact type of the design that I um that you changed. Carson, unless you see a checkpoint, there ain't a checkpoint. Hey man, not everybody can design games like Pokemon Sun and Moon. Where you fight six trainers back to back that all have one Pokemon, but in between all of those trainers, you at least get healed the full twice. Even then, I still hated that section. I mean, I, I got to that section and I was trying to figure out why I, uh, I didn't just face one trainer uh, you're, you're with talking, six Pokemon. Are you talking about the eight, that moment in the Aether Foundation? Yeah. Yeah, the, the foundation was literally the dumbest thing. You know, the funny thing game. is, like, the, the reason I actually hated that section, because it was the Aether Foundation, a lot of their Pokemon were, like, psychic types, so I could just wall everything out with the muck. So because of that, it was just losing knockoff PP. That's the only reason I hated that section. Okay, seriously, they should have put a checkpoint in between these. This is bad design right here. Mm -hmm. What do you mean? It's lost. Boss with multiple phases. Or it, it should have, if you're not going to have a checkpoint, this phase should have been like four hits. It is four hits. It is four hits. Why does it feel mm. like it's not? No, a lot because longer? Sean. I mean, I'm really bad at this section. Because that's really complicated right there. You have to get them at a good angle. Mm. So it's actually not too bad, but. See? Hmm. It, it's just... God damn it, Tails. Because you have to dodge, let them roll at you, and you have to... You know, out of all things for Metal Sonic to produce a copy of, why is he producing these things? Why didn't he just make, like, a copy of himself? Because he couldn't do that. That's too complicated. Because he is obviously the best life form as but, he is Metal Sonic. Because Metal Sonic is y using the power of the Sega CD. So with the power of the Sega CD, he's reproducing 8-bit um, Game Gear stuff. That seems like a waste of the power. <laughs> <laughs> but he can produce more of them. Is efficient. Ah, a quantity over quality. The Sega approach. Yeah. <laughs> Tell that to generations where they did only put nine stages in. Because they were rushing it because they wanted it out by holiday because Sega learned nothing. And then they were going to make DLC, but then they said the game didn't sell well enough, so they canceled it. DLC. And I know you are trying to throw uh, back, you know, on the old uh, games and things, but that model in the background shouldn't look like it came out of a Sega CD. The model's flipping. My immersion is ruined. <laughs> like, I'm not, I, I, I can't really tell if it's flipping or if it's uh, basically uh, trying to uh, resemble shading. You trying to hurts. knock him into a wall or you just... I don't think you're supposed to do that. I think you're just supposed to hit him. That's what I. Gotta go fast, Sean. Gotta go fast. 
Sonic. Cause yeah, if you get Wait, was there the actual I mean, speech in the song? Thing, we gotta talk about the fact that literally there's a See? Key. Yeah, okay. I'm not really sure how they want me to that boss because I slowed down every time I hit him. Hey. Well, that's the thing about it. Is that's what I'm saying. I'm like, you want to talk about difficulty. Let's talk about the mere fact of unfairness of that, you know, Sonic, this Metal Sonic doesn't have an animation that says, hey, if you hit me right now, then you get hurt. He just stands there. Well, he starts glowing electrically. <laughs> no, but, like, you... Here we go! Okay, guys. So my question of the day is... What did you think of Stardust Speedway? Personally, I think the stage is okay. My biggest problem is the Metal Sonic boss. I feel it's really unclear. And I think a checkpoint between the two halves would have been a nice bonus. A lot of people seem to get stumped here because they can't seem to figure out what to do or if they're even hurting the boss. And I think that's really poor game design. I think boss battles really need to be clear and properly explained and thought out. But anyway, I would really love to know what you guys think. You can leave your thoughts, opinions, and answers in the comments below, or you can leave them on social media. All my social media links are in the video description. Now, as always, I need to be a shell for a minute. If you liked my video, please hit the like button and leave some comments. If you're new to my channel and want to see more of my videos, please hit the subscription button and subscribe. If you're already subscribed, please ring the bell next to the subscription button. That gives you the proper notifications of whenever I upload a new video. Also, don't forget to follow me on social media. Doing all of these things really helps out the channel and it really helps our communities grow. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you guys next time.